this student, this is your teacher, that the cause, and today I'll be talking to you about acids, not just acid alone, I'll be majoring on organic acids. What do we mean by acids? What, whenever you hear the word acid, you know, it always comes with this emotion, ah, something that can destroy the skin, something that you must not touch the hand something that we must not even play with you know that's the notion of uh the layman but as scientists uh, what or as scientists in the making what is the meaning of acid you know acid in the olden days have been associated with sour taste something that tastes sour we usually contain an acid and uh, apart from that they are they have also been associated with their abilities to change the color of a litmus paper to from blue to red you know uh, the the word acid was coined from a latin word means acier acier is a latin word for uh, acid acier acier um, and the meaning of that acier in latin word is something that is sour, sour taste. That's the meaning of acier. Uh, so something that is sour in taste will usually be an acid and uh, their ability to change the color of litmus from blue to red uh, is how we formerly know an acid in the olden days. Uh, we have two major categories of acid based on their sources in number one we have the organic acids and we have the inorganic acid the, the, the organic acid are those present in living things like plants and animals they are organic acids and uh, we also have inorganic acids those that you prepare from mineral elements in the laboratory you call them inorganic acids or sometimes you call them mineral acid so, uh, what organic acids and their sources? Where do you get this organic acids from? Uh, organic acids are present in various uh, various sources, like for example, we have tomato contains oxalic acid. You can see that lime and lemon contain citric acid. Lime and lemon contain citric acid. You have uh, acetic acid in vinegar. You know, you normally use vinegar to manufacture all this uh, drink, all this wine. Then you have malic acid in apple. Apple contains malic acid. Then when you are sting or you are beaten by uh, by insect or by an or by ant, they usually inject acidic sting into your body. That's why you feel the sensation even after a long time of uh, being stung. So, we also have uh, lactic acid in milk. Lactic acid is present in milk. That's sour milk. Meaning that, uh, meaning that as you become sour, you see that uh, it contains lactic acid. We have tartaric acid in grapes. Grapes contain tartaric acid. So these are the different sources of uh, of organic acids uh, that we have, and we also we also have some other sources of organic acids. Uh, like for example, you are going to have amino acid in proteinous food. Foods that contain proteins. Uh, they have amino acid. Amino acid is another form of organic acids, meat, cheese, egg, beans, all these contain protein. And protein is made up of amino acid. You have fat and oil containing fatty acid. So fat and oil contains esters of fatty acids uh, in them. All those granite oil, you they have fat and oil. Then butanoic acid is a, uh, it's also an organic acid present in human sweat when you finish playing on the field and you are sweating 
there's an acid inside that sweat it's called buta, uh, butanoic acid then we have butyric acid butyric acid is present in a uh, rancid butter butter that has become uh, uh you know almost spoiling you call them rancid butter it contains a uh, butyric acid in them so uh, those are the major sources of uh organic acid well, we have organic acid in other things but for a start understand this know the fact that acids are not just uh, things that destroy that corrode acid are also useful to the human uh, to the body as you can see them in various fruits and in various food so uh, those are sources of organic acid before we end this class we are going to take some questions and I want you to do this question, write the, uh, write the answers down, and then uh, you bring it along. So you bring it along when you are coming uh, during resumption. So number one is uh, butyric acid is present in what? You can pause the video and answer the question. Acids, are they very dangerous? Are they not good for humans? Do they turn red, most people blue? They have sad tastes. The word acer is from Latin word. And what is the meaning of that word acer? Vinegar that is used for making drinks. What kind of acid is present in vinegar? Malic acid, where do you normally find malic acid? It's an organic acid. Then which type of acid is present in orange orange contains vitamin c and vitamin c is a major uh, is a major source of which type of acid listed in those options you know when you are stung with uh, insect or uh, bees what kind of acid do they inject into your bloodstream then granite oil what, what kind of uh, acid is present in its esters Then finally, amino acid, which type of food can you find amino acid? So, that will be the end of today's class. Uh, check tomorrow for the next class. Thank you.